So Fully and me, we're doing a documentary about nature. It's hard to do a documentary on nature because it's a really broad, su broad subject. So then we thought we could do like a meta documentary in which um, we are going to try to explain what the documentary about nature should be about. We thought about asking people what is documentary for them and especially what they think about the documentary about nature. If you were to shoot a nature documentary, how would you do it? And we obviously like use ideas of people to take a more global vision of what could be documentary and especially what could be documentary about the broad subject of nature. Uh, I would describe nature as whatever is around me, um, the trees, the air, the vegetation, the animals. Like the trees and the bushes and the squirrels and the rabbits and stuff, I keep it simple. The trees, the sun, the sky, the windy, the, you know, like the natural phenomena. Because nature is just anything that I can see with the naked eye. So just, you know, like I explained, squirrels, trees, sunrise, plants, you know, just everything around us. Okay, nature to me is um, just outside, <laughs> um, like trees, grass. Mm, just mm, green, I guess. We don't tend to forget about that. That nature is actually everything around us. Everything what we do, what we smell, see, sees. And it's really beautiful, always. All these shades, shadows, I don't know. And some of the like flashes of the sun on the lands. Like all the shadow, when we focused on them, they just draw a lot of different shapes on the floor, on the ground, that we'd never noticed usually because it's just natural stuff, so we are just used to it. But actually, when we really realize what is it, it becomes really beautiful. If you're making a documentary about nature, you don't just go to something beautiful or nature isn't always just waterfalls and stuff so you have to show just the just walking through the woods where nothing's really happening nature for me is just being at peace for yourself i mean because nature's beauty it shows all the beauty in some really simple things around us you technically could make a documentary without saying a thing you know you could really just take pictures of the environment and just kind of let the you know the pictures do the talking. I would just film it as it is because nature is just beautiful in itself. You really shouldn't have to explain it. It's just let it be. Nature is just uninhabited by humans. Like kind of um, just just the earth growing by itself. Anything that's not man-made. Everything that we didn't put here, it was already here when we got here. In an untouched form, like a forest or a mountain that hasn't been seen by man, is undefiled beauty. Just something that was there before we were, and is going to be there after we're gone. I feel like there could be a lot of arguments on what is defined as nature. And, you know, you can just say that, you know, we are nature. There's some people would probably think that's a dumb idea. Like, no, that's not nature, man. Just, I don't know, because I mean, you know, people get kind of tired of seeing the same thing over and over again. So when you do something a little different, it kind of opens their eyes. It really involves not only nature, like outdoors nature, like, I don't know, water, forests or something, but also very often people. I would go and describe all the plants, like I would name every plant I could. When you're filming a tree or forest in close-up, because it's a close-up, you don't have a wide view of what you are filming. You just reach a branch and you reach another branch and again and again. And at the end, you just reach the sky. You're really like focusing on a part of the tree and like, you can tell that there is a billion of different paths in nature like this. Whatever you can film, there is so much variation in just one little topic. Uh, start moving on to, to other parts of nature that 
people don't really notice or um, I guess uh, they just walk by and take for granted. You're there with the essentials that you need and you're just kind of enjoying, enjoying your surroundings. Nature at work, how everything reproduces itself, how we depend as humans on the products of nature. Uh, I'm big on like saving the planet, um, recycling, like not littering and just preserving it so we can enjoy it for a long time. Everything in nature is moving all the time. Even now there is winter, you can see everything is alive. It's again the cycle of life.